welcome back to Joe the, Henry's the Wars. Two Towers. <laughs> we went very different directions. <laughs> I was going to go for another two something. Two uh, de -de -de -dum -de -de -do. Yeah. There we go. But yeah, no, just watch some Joe Hendry entrance themes because they're fun. <laughs> I'm Joseph Con. And Joseph Connors. <laughs> You talked about that in Croc the first time, and it sounded very funny then. It's still very funny now. I love it. It's it's a brilliant it's a brilliant gag. Uh, They're all I'm, pretty funny. I'm a bit surprised it led to Joseph Connors turning heel rather than Hendry, but because yeah, he was hard he was annoyed. Him, but you know, Joseph Connors was a fantastic evil champion, and then Hendry eventually was a fantastic evil champion as well. <laughs> After uh, after Connors went to the WWE, wasn't he somewhere in the middle between oh. cocky, arrogant heel and dumb, cowardly heel? Who? Connors. Hendry. Because I seem to recall he came out on a couple of nights like you know, I'd fight, yeah. but oh uh, man, you yeah. know that thing. Basically, yeah. You know the thing. Yeah, but no, but like you know, remember that time he gave. Um, Gave Kirby just the most disgusting concussion. Yeah. Work, it was, it apparently it was a total work. Like, there was no actual damage involved, but... That is amazing, because to look at it... Yeah, he... and the entire crowd yelling, stop this match. Which oh, wow. is very, yeah, no. You don't get that with, like... You, you don't get that, you don't, WCPW, you don't get that in modern wrestling. <laughs> Because people are like, people know. Oh, it's all a joke. Yeah, people assume you can do, you can fake everything. Yeah, but no, this like he was literally getting his this head was smacked off the canvas. Stop it! He's already he'd dead. Gone, he'd gone totally limp. Wow. It was disgusting. <laughs> oh. If you can imagine a sack of potatoes just being kicked over, yeah. that's what this move looked he, like. He like he put him in the tree of woe and was just smacking his head off the canvas and it's, oh, horrible. Absolutely. Thank you, underscoring Thank you. sound from car. <laughs> Thank you. That is appropriate. I would say. That's how the yeah. match felt watching it. Yeah. Yeah. No. It's like a car Ooh. crash. Which made it uh, fun to watch World of Sport uh, last week, uh, which was the first episode of the new World of Sport Wrestling show on ITV, uh, and uh, Hendry and uh, Hendry and uh, Kirby were a tag team. Ah. And then halfway through the match, Kirby just kind of like hops down off the apron and is like, nah, you're all right. And just goes to the back while, while Hendry gets uh, wrecked by two people. And it's like, yeah, no, fair enough. Last last thing I remember them doing in the ring together was that. I really do like a lot of what Martin Kirby does. Because one of the last things I saw of him was interrupting a match with Damien Dunn as the police. Yeah. Just modern Kirby goes insane for a bit. Hmm. Oh, turn that down to play wow. Because I turned that up a bit to play that other game. Because really wow, yeah. I went, are they playing Duel of Fates? And they were. Hmm. <laughs> uh, Which video was that, I wonder? I, oh, Star Wars Fun Times. No, now you got to call it that. And um, that was the intent. <laughs> it's weird because there's a friend of mine who's in Pro-Am Wrestling. And one of, the, I, I don't know if it's one of the events he is at or that he is working at, has Martin Kirby on the card. But his gimmick there is blue and silver, not pink and yellow. Weird. Right? He's still the same, you know, item Martin Kirby doll, who is apparently Zach Gibson. <laughs> yeah, that was not a very Yorkshire <laughs> accent. <laughs> oh, wrestling. But yeah, no, he's he's not got the Kirby and Stars color scheme that he has. That I'm. Wait, is that the door that what? opens? That wasn't open, correct? Hit, hit the hit the switch again. I think that up fitty. I think that door did open though. I think it glitched. Do you maybe gotta go back to the top of the? You got like climb up the tree behind you. Oh, the prince! Why? One, two. Prince is in this game now. That's what I said <laughs> now. What I know what the welcome to next to. week is going to be. <laughs> <laughs> Getting lost. After I said I haven't got lost yet. How embarrassing. Oh no, you can, you can do this now. What do? <laughs> do, 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 do. 
No, that's the chorus bit when they just go and do do do. What do? go? What do? Where go? What do? Skip it about do. Something about the raw theme. Tell me then, what do you believe it is to be Okay, the prince is narrating something, so I think we're on progression. Get it on progression. Do all the stealth kills. Do all the fudging stealth kills. Do all the stealth kills. Yeah. And yeah. Joseph Connors. <laughs> yep. Ah. <laughs> uh, Right, no, when he came back in the in the World Cup. In the Dub CBW World Cup. Yes. And they were just like, Ah, well, you know, Michael Elgin can't be here for some reason. So, you know, I've made some calls and I've got a replacement. And then you just get like the opening chords of his music and the crowd's like oh, what 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 is it? and then it fully hits with Joseph Connors <laughs> and the loudest pop of the whole tournament, I swear. Oh, it was great. Probab was this... Probably my favourite um, entrance theme of any wrestler. Was this the one where they got two of the wrestlers wrong? No. I want to say, was it the Sushi Boys? It was Cho and Sho Tanaka and the Oh, no, that was the, the crowd. No, the crowd. The crowd got them mixed up. Okay. How embarrassing. Yeah. For us, that we were a part of this. Well, yeah, but it was like there was a section of the crowd that was making a big point of cheering the Japanese wrestlers by name, and it was them that got it wrong. <laughs> we were trusting their greater knowledge. Yeah. The main oh, highlight of that was when we got the Go Go Tiger chant going, just like in his theme tune. Go Go Tiger. Go Go Tiger. Connor was trying like to. Guy. Connor was trying to get a kill the tiger chant. Going. Yeah. <laughs> What's that? People weren't up for it. Got told to shut up. What's that? People weren't up for cheering the heel. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, she. Look at this combat. Look at it go. Look at this combat because I failed the stealth. But I killed the captain, so it's fine. El Capitano. What'd I get? You, you have gained, gained a new sand tank! Panzer tank just comes That's in. what I was thinking! <laughs> it was that or the two fish in a tank joke, but I'm not gonna do that. Sure hope a dumb sequence involving riding a giant golem isn't gonna happen soon. <laughs> What's that? I was thinking the wrong kind of golem. That'd be stupid. Oh. What's that? Shadow of the Colossus, you say? What's that, precious? Why are we in Persia? <laughs> why, why are you on top of me? <laughs> oh, why are you all so small? We're supposed to be the small one, precious. Stop it. Never. I can't do a golem voice, but... The dagger, give it to us. I used to be able to do it really well. But yeah, every time, time I try, it just becomes Sid the Sloth. Did anyone pay attention to that mini cutscene that showed me where to go? Pay no, attention, you say? No. <laughs> no, I was thinking of Shadow of the Colossus. Uh, I was thinking of Gollum. <laughs> you have to pay attention because you to know where I go. Sorry. Sorry. Just carry on. Uh, yeah, I think you got to go back the way you... Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, we found the it. grooves have been found. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Amazing. You, don't, you, you never have to apologize for referencing <laughs> that guy. Wait, no, this is where I was before. Oh. Where does this go? Oh, have you way? actually been paying attention to the oh, grooves? Oh, so you go that way? That's where I came from. It's everywhere where you came from. Because I'm the prince. That's my city. I can be anywhere whenever I want. Do <laughs> Up. Go up there. Go up there. Where is this? I'm gonna go up this tree. Where's it go? Goes up to the tree bit. Oh, there oh. we go. Oh. Goes to the thing I'm supposed yeah. to go to. Oh, that's right. This what the is that rebar? Go. Your rebar. Not a rebar. I beam. A true Get that right. A rebar, you say? 
And what of the man that what is happening? Go on, do your job. <laughs> no, no, I'm, I'm just trying to remember who the the Ariba man was in the new generation WWE. Oh, I thought you were Aldo like... Montoya. No, Tito Santana. Speedy Gonzalez. Oh yeah, him too. Mandalay. W U. Nerd. I nearly swore. Oh, I forgot the. <laughs> Actually forgot the button. The button didn't button. Had like this a really looks like a beautiful like a place. Look senior at this. moment just then. He's dead. He, is How? He? Yeah. See, I, I would, you know, I wouldn't have wanted to teach, like back in Manchester, Whoa. I wouldn't have wanted to teach those kids Babylonian history, because, oh. you know, you're trying to tell them about the hanging gardens, <laughs> and hanging in the slang of the time meant disgusting. Oh, I thought so, you meant like the hanging gardens that were just hanging out. No, no, the hang, hanging gardens. Because it, it means means horrible, like disgusting, revolting oh, gardens. Oh, 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 hanging gardens. Don't like that. Look at this camera. That is a cutie, by the way. We've been talking about cuties. Mm. Because the first couple, step colors are cutie. the first couple flash up on the screen. They all flash up on the screen because I'm so quick on it. Baby. I've not seen any on screen. It's because I'm so quick, yo. No, seriously, like the, the first couple no. of monsters you kill, the little cutie pops up and it says, "Oh, push square there." Do oh, the I thought you meant the thing flashes. Oh no, I see it like slow down and flash. Yeah. The actual text, push. Yeah, it did say that. Yeah, do not die. Well, it's a stupid tree man golem. But not that golem. Or oh, that tree man. Also, a reskin of a boss from the Warrior Within. That's not much of a Colossus. That's like the end of Shadow of Colossus and the money it's ran out. It's bigger than. The... Are you crazy? It's bigger than the pig one. Yeah, but look at 15 and 16. The two biggest. Well, no, 16 is big. Isn't 16... Yeah, 16 is the one that's the entire mountain. 16 right? is a goddamn skyscraper with a head and arms. And he can't move because he's so big. Did I mention this yet? I've put up the map from that game in my lounge at work. Oh, if it, I would love that map on my wall. Because, um... So the way it goes is they put me in charge of getting customer responses what? on the feedback form. Mm -hmm. No one's into that. So what I've done, I've put up this treasure map consisting of 80 squares. Wink. And it's just the, the forbidden ones. Because it's a neat map with no writing on it and a big grid in it. Yeah, it's really simple. And every time you get a bit of feedback, you just pick a square and you get whatever's under it. It's like a mystery advent calendar. Yeah. Wait, that's for the oh, employees of for the customers. Um, employees at the store who get customer feedback. Oh, right. Does anyone ever say, Yo, it's the Shadow of the Colossus, man? Nope. Oh. Nobody has pulled this up yet. There is no surprise on my surprised. face. Uneducated fools. I'm not playing a video game. I'm not playing a really good video game. It's, it's a masterpiece. A masterpiece. I've run the wrong way. Where do you go? Where do you go? Where do you go? I... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and he killed you from that, because he fell on you! Welcome to Crash Bandicoot, apparently. Just <laughs> like Soul Calibur 2! Three! Whatever one it was when you fight the Colossus of Rhodes. I don't know. I think it was Connor who told us all that. No, it was you. It was, it was me. It was Andy. Oh. So you should know. Because Simon went, I you're being that. stupid, right? That's not a thing. Yeah, I didn't believe it. How these flips? Are you impressed, Tree Man? They're not Obi Wan flips. No, no, not Obi Wan flips. And I'm not murdering innocent either. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's presumably done something to warrant defending his territory against you. He's a sand demon. Oh, you can not climb on. I think I played Shadow of the Colossus either a demo or like my friends had a copy. And I'm like, this is kind of boring, where is my story? Yeah. And it was there. Was like, this is when I was young and stupid it. and didn't get the... Oh, there it is. It's all background storytelling. Mm -hmm. That's because that was really rare at the time. 
this Dark Souls hadn't happened, and Shadow of the Colossus is probably more subtle than that. Um, Climb on them! Keep in that. <laughs> well, cause really, because there is no story. You just, Thank you. you just, you know, you get to the ending, and then the thing happens at the end. Yeah, I, go. I guess it's just a simple story. When you, get back to it. you don't get a, you know. But you know what was this place? Yeah. Is the main one that people speculate. I like signs that. Signs of life, you know, there's little cities and things. Yeah. There's the beach from Ico. That's the most prevalent oh. one. See, I have no love for Ico, so it doesn't really gel with me. I, I'm not keen on the game, but I like that Team Ico have gone, maybe it's contiguous world? Well, it is. Maybe not? Well, it is. Come on, after that ending to yeah. Shadow. But, but yeah, you're right. Before then, they were like, maybe it doesn't I don't know. Uh, oh, by the way, you can find the blade from that game over here. It's pretty good. It doesn't help that I played that after Shadow. I, I want to say that track. was an instance of reading other memory cards. Hmm? I, I, I want to say if you have a save for Ico, then you get the sword in Shadow of the Colossus. Oh, yeah, maybe. Maybe. Because all I'm thinking of now is the, the goofy junk in Silent Hill 3. Yeah. If you've got a Silent Hill 2 save file, Heather just... No letter here. Not even from a dead wife. I don't have one <laughs> of those. Why did I say that? <laughs> or you can not put your hand in a toilet, because what kind of idiot would do that? <laughs> what sick person would do such a thing? That's basically what she's like. She turns to camera. She's like, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. Ah! So stupid, why did that do that? I think this is a helpful grade. Remember all the times I said that in the last game? I do remember! <laughs> this looks like it a helpful though. grade though. It was a really easy one. I don't know, getting here. Oh yeah, I forgot. Now it beginner. I forgot about that. Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> No, I feel so It's certainly not the blue shadow realm. Oh! The shadow. The shadow. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get into that again. Oh, God. I didn't even need to say it this time. Uh, no, I'm okay. I'm okay. didn't even need to I say it. I nearly died last time, but I'm okay this time. gormless looking old man <laughs> trapped in a TV. <laughs> 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 what will you do now? Your grandpa's soul is in the shadow realm. <laughs> oh no. Okay, Dan, let's say it's, I'm not, it's not as bad as last time. It's getting better. Every time it's getting better. I don't know that. I didn't even say it that time when you were. When you were. You had been guard broke. Uh, is that still going? I feel like that wasn't as funny as it kept going. No, it, to be honest, oh. even, it wasn't that funny at the beginning. Uh, no, it really wasn't. It was it it just hit the you know the the comedic zeitgeist of yeah. the late 2000s it's just something that you've completely forget about and you've never yeah. realized how and then, you never thought about it long enough to realize how stupid and kind of hilarious yeah, it is yeah and then i remember that you know yugi's grandpa stuck in the tv <laughs> And this happened why? at, like, every D&D &D for, like, the last three <laughs> sessions of, you know, we'll mention Shadowfell, which is a realm of, <laughs> of the, the Fade Plains or something, uh, which immediately will cause people to say, the Shadow, Shadow Realm, realm. <laughs> and then will um, immediately lead to And then Simon, and then Simon will <laughs> mention Yugi's grandpa stuck in the TV, <laughs> and then I would be unable to breathe for the next five minutes. <laughs> Every time Simon has mentioned the Shadow Room, he's adjusted his glasses oh, while doing it. It's because I'm crying. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's like a subconscious sort of... Hmm. Oh, it might be. It might be like a... I'm doing that anime character thing of... Push them up with your middle push, finger. Push them up and... Oh, yeah. no. I, I... Right. I heard about a... I say, I don't know how true this is because I heard about it on the internet. But apparently there was a guy who was very into his anime and he'd learned his Japanese... And he was just at a pub. Okay. And he noticed uh, a an, an Asian lady. 
So he goes over and starts talking in Japanese and uh, doing the anime, you know, rub the back of the head oh bashfully. God, no. And all the while she's going, I don't understand you. I'm from Vietnam. Oh. I don't I don't even speak Vietnamese. That's I only the bad one. I've lived in America all my life. <laughs> I don't I don't know what you're saying. And he just won't stop. Oh, talking he to just someone keeps using going. anime mannerisms. Yeah. That's terrible. That's bad. Not even from the right country. And you know, doubly yeah. so because she was American. And she was, yeah. So we're in my college computing lecture this one time. My friend Mike is sitting next to me. He is singing I Like Chinese, the Monty Python song. Catherine Fan turns around and goes, You know, Mike, some people might find that a little bit offensive. Mm. And he says, I didn't know you were Chinese. She says, I'm not. I'm Korean. And Mike says, Well then! And takes it from the top. Okay. Bastion of maturity was Mike Jones. Hmm. Leap in that name. <laughs> Jones Mike. Or am I? Oh, I gotta bleep that as well. <laughs> Just put a backwards bleep on that one. <laughs> <laughs> Peel. Well, it's one of those things where, like, he would very often go up to people and go, like, oh, guess my name. Guess my name. Smith. Close. It's not though. Well, no, it's the other one. Nice boat. Well, now everyone knows what it is. I didn't say what it is, though. They have inferred. They have inferred that it's a name that isn't Smith. Yeah, well, you said it's the other one. Well, it could be the other, other really one. common one. Like Fletcher or Baker? Come on. Yeah. Or Thompson or Wilson. Or Where Williams. were you at the pub quiz the other night? The question was, top three Welsh surnames beginning with A. Or oh, it's not the most common Welsh surname beginning with A. Beginning with A? Yeah. And I thought, oh man, if only Simon was here, he would know, he'd at least have a guess. Well, the problem is, technically all of them should begin with A in the same way that Scottish ones should begin with M. But that didn't happen with Anglicisation. So, what, I don't what, know. I can't think of any off the top of my head. I want to say one of them was like Alan. I forget what the other two are. Hmm. And or... Yeah. Warning, there is a puzzle coming up that I was always really bad at as, as okay. a team. Just a warning there. I might have to give it I... to my big brother over there.